this morning, Marg and I are at the Andaz and we're going to try out their breakfast. They actually have a special on which concludes this weekend unfortunately, it's a two for one special. So we're going to indulge ourselves this morning with a luxury breakfast and let's have a look around the grounds too. On entering through Andes's reception, you're greeted with the village square, which is placed on a typical Balinese village, where the square is prominent and, and in the case of the Andes, it's surrounded by a number of the restaurants. As you can see from the menu, there are no prices. The breakfast is fixed price a la carte, and you can choose whatever you want from the menu, as much as you like. So this is the Anders Hotel, we've come for breakfast, absolutely beautiful, we're just looking at how the other half live, it's about, I don't know, 500 a night to stay here. Birthday breakfast at Anders, yay, happy birthday to me, look at this, this is French toast with grilled pineapple. And ice cream, like who has ice cream for breakfast? I do. <laughs> <laughs> and a coffee, of course. And there is a souffle pancake. Beautiful. And my flat white for the morning. Taste tester. to say it is the hottest coffee that I've come across so far all the others pale into insignificance as far as the heat factor goes and it is a rather tasty blend um, quite nice and the the winning factor is it's hot here we are at the lovely Andaz village square restaurant for breakfast Not very busy, but there's a number of people in. I think what the idea is, there is a two for one special on for this weekend. I think this is the last weekend they have it and it's to attract new um, customers, I suppose you could say, into the hotel complex. Maybe give them some idea as to what you might find in the Andes and I think most of us would know what we would find in the Andes it's going to be fairly luxurious but uh, we're enjoying a nice a la carte breakfast at the moment and service is great there is 101 waiters and waitresses just begging to serve you it's, it's very good service it's excellent service Okay, if you are intending to consider coming down to the Andes for a breakfast, you will need to book, but they will treat you like royalty if you do. Birthday breakfast course two is a croix madame, which is a Danish with cheese mornay, ham, egg, provolone cheese and tarragon. Yum, look at it! <laughs> Next course is a crepe fromage. Cheese pancake, I would suspect. 
It's all nicely folded up into a square. Souffle pancake was very fluffy, very nice. Maple syrup was was really required because it did get a bit doughy towards the end there, but it was fantastic. Let's have a look at this one. Crepe fromage was lovely, a very light crepe filled with mushroom. Um, components of it are Gruyere cheese, portobello, creme fraiche, which is on the side, and tomato and shallots as a dressing. That was a nice one. Yes. Okay, we're back for course number three. I've lost track. <laughs> It's a <laughs> we've, lot. we've got a new flat white, we've got a sourdough, tasted sourdough, mashed avocado, or avocado mash as we like to call it at the end days. And Marg has got something extremely exotic. <laughs> it's some kind of Bobby Gooling something or other, so it's pork and rice, of course, and it looks delicious. Looks like some kind of roulade or something. And there was a bucket load of avocado, so I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get through all of it on one piece of sourdough. That looks scrumptious. This is called a croffle, so it's a cross, I think, between a croissant and a waffle. So it's got banana and chocolate and miso butter, and it looks delicious. Next breakfast dish of the day is chicken satay. Not everybody's usual breakfast dish, but why not? It's on the menu and you can have as much as you want. To seven sixteen fifty what for? cocktails. Whoa. <laughs> right, after breakfast we're gonna go for a little stroll around the grounds, have a look at what Pandas has to offer as far as gardens, and we might even get a sneak preview of a room. and a very decorative place. Pathways around the Andes are easy to traverse, they're quite wide, they are very well signposted. You walk past quite a number of water features, uh, the gardens, it's very lush. It has a tranquility about it, there's birds singing. It's totally different to being in the central area of Sonora. You would think you were somewhere else. It's just a completely different atmosphere and ambience that you'll find at the end of this.
Now, for currently 558 Australian dollars, this is what you would expect in your Andes suite, and this one is Lagoon Access, which opens out onto the veranda. There is a separate living area with 65 inch TV, coffee making machines, and kettles as well. It has king size bed, a 65 inch flat screen TV. There are two toilets. There is a bathroom, an oversized bathroom with bath, soaking tub and rain shower. All amenities are provided, soaps, conditioners, shampoos and all other wonderful things that you'd like to expect in your bathroom. There are hair dryers, you supplied with robes and slippers and it is climate controlled. This one is 871 square feet, including the 39 square metre spacious living area outside, which is furnished, gives you access to the pools and also immediate access to the pathways to the village square and also to the beach. The Andes has three swimming pools. This one, the Liang, is the ocean facing pool. The other one we've just passed is called the Santhi Pool. There is also a kids pool called Alip. And along with the four restaurants that border the village square, this one on the beachfront is called the Fisherman's Club and they're offering lunch and dinners, happy hour, snacks, uh, kids foods. Then from the village square you will come through reception and from reception you go through this amazing little koi pool, decorative pool, filled with albino koi fish. They're deadly white as you can see. And from there it's through to the main gates where drivers generally come through and collect or drop off.
Thanks for watching our videos. Please like and share them. Also, please leave a comment. And most importantly, don't, don't forget, forget to, to subscribe. subscribe. We would really appreciate your support.